Well, the roads are terrible tonight, and with temperatures dropping, they could get a lot worse. Nine on your side's Jason Law drove up and down the interstates tonight and found several situations in which drivers lost control. Jason? Yeah, Clyde, it's just been one of those nights. On Interstate 71 tonight, we found a family of four stranded on the side of the road. The deputy who helped the family told me that there were accidents everywhere tonight. Interstate 71 North near 275 was bumper to bumper Friday night because of this. The Jeep lost control and went sideways. And when it did, the car overreacted, went up under the rear of the tractor trailer. And that smacked him right into the side of the wall. This trucker described the accident that sidelined two semi trucks and sent one young driver to the hospital. The young ladies driving the Jeep didn't know how to react to, uh, to the snow and the ice. They were young girls, teenage girls. Oh, you, and you think it was, it was a young driver? Uh, yeah, and uh, they may just not have had the experience for the weather condition. A few miles away, we found a far less serious situation. William Johnson was driving his family to the mall when he spun out near the Montgomery Road exit. So what happened? When did you feel like you were losing control? Um, as soon as I got right past the sign, lost control a little bit, ended up in the ditch. Should have got off at the other exit instead of this one. A few minutes later, a sheriff's office deputy helped the family get back on the road. On a scale of 1 to 10, how bad do you think the roads were tonight? 8. An eight? Yes. When the weather's like this and when the roads are this bad, uh, what advice do you have? Get off the road. <laughs> and how often do we say that? Well, tonight people seem to be paying attention. You're looking live now at Interstate 71, and at this hour, the roads are pretty empty. We're live in Norwood tonight. Jason Law, not on your side.